and welcome back. Hey, this is uh, J and J do things. I'm Jack, and I'm here with Justin. Sup? And uh, once again, we're going to be playing some Dark Souls Three. Dark Souls Three. So, in the previous episode, quick recap: we got through, we beat out. I say we, like I'm. Doing anything. <laughs> like God you helped. <laughs> Beep. <laughs> I already said it. Uh <laughs> like I like like I'm doing anything. Justin beat uh Gundy, or Gundam or whatever his name is, I can never remember off the top of my head. And uh we have made it to Filing Shrine. He has leveled up to level two, I think. Whatever he is now. And uh we're just gonna continue on from there. Yeah. So Justin, the next step, Actually, if you're about. not too aware is you can travel use the bonfire to travel straight away basically oh and you're going to be going to the high wall of lothric to get the game started is, is there anything worth running around and exploring here or shall I, is that just going to be boring shall I just... there are places you can explore here but there's also a, a big place that you're locked out of until you get like enough what, souls. what would my dark souls expert recommend um i don't know if it's patched but there is a tree jump you can try but you seem to suck at jumping in the previous episode, yeah, so we're going to give that a miss. And jump just, in. Yeah. just push forward, I'd say. So, bonfire. Yeah, bonfire. Okay. I have to say, I love Iron Brew. <laughs> Iron Brew. Yeah, it is nice. Probably one of my favorite orange drinks. <clears throat> right, right up there with me. orange juice. I do like some orange juice. Well, Orange, you glad you shared that with us? Because <laughs> I'm not. <laughs> oh, well done. Well done. Oh, my word. So, yeah. So this is going to be the High Wall of Lothric. Mm -hmm. When you start here, you've got two directions to go. You've got like, left and right, if we're being arbitrary about it. Oh. If you go left, you progress. If you go right, there's like a little kind of side area for exploration. Okay. So... I'd probably say go right to start with. Get some get some souls under your, under your yeah, tuckers. Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll go get some gubs. Yeah, get some skilly goalies. Hmm. Left, right, right, left, something like that. So, what? Um... I don't actually know what that is. I thought that was the Lord Vessel when I first saw it because it looks. It's a bonfire kind of... sword. It is, it is a coiled sword, but it looks to me like the Lord Vessel from Dark Souls One. Could well be. Which, yeah, if it is, it's a nice nod back. I'll actually have to look into that later. And uh, if I could be bothered, put a disclaimer up being like, disclaimer, Jack was wrong. <laughs> <laughs> just like a floating bit of text just creep up from underneath me like, <laughs> wrong, bitch. Extra, extra, hot off the presses. Jack's wrong. <laughs> so, right. There you go. High wall of Lothric. Let's see how this plays out. It'll be oh, fine. Good news. Do you want to know what the good news is? Um... Yeah, go on then. Ragdoll physics are back. Yeah! Oh, I have not noticed that yet. Ooh, bonfire. Also, I... Th um, mm. Correct me if I'm wrong. Mm -hmm. I think your east-west shield has high magic resistance. I think that's what that little symbol means. It looks like something, doesn't it? Yeah. The only thing I remember from... Dark Souls one would be kind of looks divine, but divine, I don't know if divine is still it. Yeah, divine. Still there's divine and darkness and all that and what have you. So I'm gonna go this way. So yeah, this is like the little kind of side area, optional path. Path, I'd say. Right. Okay. Ooh, dogs. Wah. Woof. Oh, look at him go. He just oh. wants to hug you. Oh, God. That didn't go well. Hey, you survived, though. That's the important part. Bigger dog. All right. Okay. Right. So, I understand. Okay, hear me out. Yeah, go on. I understand that with zombies, they've got muscle fiber. Yeah. How the fuck does a skeleton get about without muscle fiber? Uh, yeah! Um, <laughs> magic? Fuck your magic. God, it's gonna be so... Is this... Are we even, like, two minutes in yet? Uh, we're about four minutes. <laughs> Something like that. I'll probably bleep them anyway, just for, just, just for the sake of it. Darn it. Oh! Oh, yeah, there's a dude up there, by the way. He's shooting arrows at you. 
Why would I get him? I can't get him. Well, you go back up there and just... Aha! You fool! I have come to you. Oh, them backstabs do. Progressing forward. Like, down to your left is a, a, a return area from a shortcut, basically. Or a shortcut which you activate later in this area. Okay, so don't go down there. Well, you can do. I mean, there's nothing you can do. It's a, it's the, <laughs> there is a, 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 a push door down there, which you tried to pull. <laughs> All right, one of those. Yeah. So Sorry, a pull door like, which you tried like to push. Like a door that doesn't open from both sides. Pretty much. A door that defies all logic and physics. Isn't that all doors, though? Don't all doors only open realistically from what? Oh. What the? Plus oh. man's back. Yeah, I'm, I'm not going to finish that. I, I thought that was a bit stupid. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to need a minute. <laughs> <laughs> this is where Justin then concentrates a bit too hard and forgets how to talk. So unfortunately, you get to put up my dulcet tones for the time being. Oh, you got me, bro. Nah, you're good. You're good. Heal. Oof. Well, Already out of Estus. Estus. That's not good. No Sunny D for this boy. He's going to get me. Nah, you're fine. Die. He's d Go on. You're both at the same health. Throw a fireball at him. No, he got me. Uh, oh, no, that's sure not that's, good. Uh, number two, there. That's not good at all. I'll never do it. I'll, I'll be happy with with one death per episode. If I can deal with one death per episode, I think I'll be all right with that. So all I got to do now is not die. Are you using this as like your claim to? You're saying that you're only gonna have one death per episode? Yeah. Good luck. It'll be fine. I'll <laughs> be fine. Having a little look see at what I got. Oh yeah, who doesn't love a bit of menuing? What's Ashenestus? So Ashenestus is your FP to to refill your magic stuff. Ah oh, right. Okay. You can speak to um the blacksmith back in Phalanx Shrine hmm. and he can allot your Estus depending on how you want to do your play. What do you mean by that? So you can split your current three that you've got now. Yeah. You can split that between two Estus and two Ashen, or three Estus, one Ashen, kind of thing. So I get um, so I can get more Estus. Um, I can't. I don't know if you can leave yourself with zero off the top of my head. You might um, be able to. It might be worth a try. Worth trying, really. Yeah, quick. give it a go. I mean, load times in this game aren't too bad, especially when traveling between areas. Yeah, if I, if I can get one more, then I'll I'll be happy with that. Plus, um, uh, the in every he was menu, here, wasn't he? the... yeah, he'd be in Firelink Shrine. In every like fast travel menu, at the very bottom, Firelink Shrine's always there, so you just have to press oh, up, and you can always go. That's nice. Through. Which look makes look life look a little bit easier. all nice and friendly for a change. And then it's like, hey, welcome to the swamps. <laughs> Is the swamps like, uh, like your blight towns? Who knows, man? Who knows? I'm gonna shrug that off and uh, dodge that question. So, oh, it's Andre from the first one. Yeah, man. He just he fucking lives forever. This lad. He's just done died, is he? <laughs> he just done give fuck. Let me smith your weapons. So if you go to reinforce Estus towards the bottom there, uh, sorry, not reinforce a lot, a lot, <laughs> or a little. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. So that's oh, four action. Oh, that's cool. So yeah, you can leave some. Well, I'm not going for magic at all, so I'm just gonna chuck it all in there. Free Estus, like in it. Pretty be careful. Why is there not four now? Oh, is it because I need a rest of the bomb? Yeah, maybe? yeah. You need to upload, uh, upload it, update it, and then that, that's that's her. That's the cutie. So let's go to back where we were. <laughs> yeah, that. Excuse me. So you're gonna push through. Are you gonna go back and get your souls? Um. Yeah, I think I will. Let's try all that again. I'll just suck less. <laughs> Get good. Get good, son. Get good, Scoop. Sorry, there's, um, this area is really kind of forgiving to start with. Yeah, I just feel like I'm I'm just playing badly. That's, that's all it is. I just He's need just to bad. concentrate a bit more. Suck it up and get on with it. Yeah. 
be a bit less greedy, I think. He says, immediately killing a harmless hollow. <laughs> Give me your 30 souls! Fucking pickpocketing the dead. <laughs> That's what you're doing right now. Oh, I... Damn, these dogs are messing you up. Yeah, they are, neat. Don't forget about that guy up there. There yeah. he is. He's going for you with those arrows. Those crossbow bolts. Ooh, light crossbow. You know, other than Dark Souls 1, I don't think I ever actually use... Mu oh, actually, no, that's a lie. I do use a fair bit of ranged weaponry. Eh? Uh, no. Teleport key. Um, I used poison arrows a lot in Dark Souls 1. <laughs> For the um, you know the silver knight douchebags. Oh, they're in, fucking um, fun. Is it? Oh, what, what, what was the place? That's it. Yeah, Anolando. If you've played any of the Dark Souls before, you know. <laughs> yeah, you know. God, you... they suck. So, right, immediately to your right, get rid of that hollow in the middle, or the one that's standing up. Ah, uh, you weren't quick enough. That's all right. I, I want to prove myself anyway, so I want to prove I can do it. They locked my souls. So in Dark Souls 1, back in Anna Londo, I'm just going to talk to you now while I try yeah, and distract you. Yeah, you. You talk, I'll concentrate. So you know you had to go all the way around the outside of the castle and up the spiral staircase and do a load of stuff up there and come back down the other side. Yeah, yeah. You didn't have to do any of that. There is a skip you can do, which is still in the game, which allows you to... Ah. Oh. So one death per episode, he says. This is not a good start. <laughs> this is not a good start. I swear. I should be better than this, right? Yeah, you should I, be. I platinum the first one. I looked at the second one. <laughs> <laughs> I uninstalled the second one. <laughs> so, anyway. Yeah, you didn't have to go all the way up and round in Lothric Castle. All you had to do is go half, like halfway up the spiral staircase, and then you can jump over the railing to skip the entire place. Wait, hang on. E explain I'll that again. I'll show you at some point. But in Anolondo, yeah, where you go, or you know, you go, you like climb around the outside where the uh, Silver Knight archers are. Yeah, the bastards that knock you off. The the bow and arrow douchebag. Yeah, 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 yeah. With the giant. Yeah, thing. yeah. When you get in, like when you first enter the cut, the, the Anolondo Castle, you know, you the you, ha you go down that hallway and then up the spiral staircase. Yeah. You don't have to go up, all the way up and do that, like, area up there. You can just jump over the banister in the spiral staircase and skip everything entirely and just progress to Ornstein and Smo. Oh. Like, super quickly. You skip, like, an hour's worth of... Well, that's really annoying. An I wish I knew shit. that. An hour's worth of stuff, like... Oh, my God. This guy hits like a fucking truck. That's why you need to just rush him. The next time you, next time you die, because you will, just rush him when you get here. Like, don't don't fanny about with any of the other hollows. Just just literally. Do you know what? Bum rush him. I might I might bail. He's gonna follow you. I want my See? souls though. <laughs> oh! <laughs> three. <sighs> That's three times in one episode, that mate. That is. That is, isn't it? That's the third one. <laughs> you can't die for the next three episodes, two episodes. Not even that many souls. Is there anything up there? Who knows, man. Ugh. I'm going to go a different way. All right. Wimp. I think I'm just not having a Dark Souls kind of day. Maybe that's what's wrong with me. What a little wimpy is, eh, guys? <laughs> oh, my days. Come on, wake up. Come on, mate. What's wrong with you today? I don't know. You got this. You got this. So you aiming to have like your typical strength dex build? Like, yeah, what, what pretty much. This yeah, I mean, I've never been, I've never done a sorcerer build. Or <laughs> I reckon you should give it a go at some point. They yeah, are a maybe lot. Of maybe fun. when we do the um, 
the randomizer ones. I'll I'll give um pyromancy or sorcery a well, if you're playing Pyromancy and Dark Souls 1, you've basically just cheesed the game. Is it? Yeah. Pyromancy and Dark Souls 1 is so overpowered. I don't know how I feel about that. I mean, Stop I'm, killing I... the innocent ones! You're gonna get fucked by the other ones now. Kill everything. See? See? Oh! Oh! See? Oh! Oh! oh. This is what Come happens on. when you try and be a dick. <laughs> Come on, make it number four. Make it number four in episode, four and one episode, please. This is ridiculous. Oh my god. <laughs> Be better. <laughs> it came out of nowhere. Oh dear. Bonk. Who's doing that? Oh, he's up there. <laughs> it's your boy going, Kobe. <laughs> oh! <laughs> I can't even do the first... Get in here! It's alright, buddy. We're coming up to being halfway through. We're gonna take a walk after you've done it's this my episode. Fault. It's my fault, because I gave it the big I am. I was like, oh yeah, I've, I've, I've platinum Dark Souls 1, yeah, I'll fucking walk through it. Now look at me. I'm looking at you, mate, and I can see that your face is getting redder. Yeah. <laughs> It, I, it this this isn't like you know this isn't built up or anything this this is anger this is this is just yeah to be fair you ruining. were pretty chill before we started doing all of this yeah I was having a nice day <laughs> <Wait a minute. laughs> hey, just rush him just rush him don't let him sweat swing because that's what gets their attentions and that's what starts starts all this happening. You need to, like, in this beginning area, you need to, like, ignore the praying hollows for the time being. Yeah. Because they're doing nothing. They're just, they're just fodder for the time being. You need to focus on the ones that are coming straight for you. Yeah. I need to, I need to mix it up a bit then I'm... Shake it off. Get out of this. Get out of this funk. Yeah. Like... <laughs> <laughs> Need to ignore those ones. Yeah, immediately goes to kill them. Well, there's to... nothing else there, so I can do. Are you sure? Because there's something there. Just rush this dude. Rush this dude. Yeah, there's a chair. Fine, cool. Chair. So those two will stay down for the time being. So you can attack them whenever you want. Now, I suggest just smacking them now. Yeah. Okay. But you're not going to get bum rushed by them this time unless you activate both of them. Well, like that. Like that. Nah, that's good. So smack him. Go get your souls. I go mess up um, Kobe up top there. See, this is better. I've got I've got my expert actually giving me advice now. This is nice. Well, it's because I don't want to like ruin things for you. I don't want to be like, oh yeah, you should be playing it like this and being like that person. Because on one hand, by God, I hate the way you play this. What, really? <laughs> do you hear it? <laughs> Why do you hear it? Because since I've done this so many times, I know your experience and everything for the first time, and I'm just like, there's nothing up there. There's nothing oh, up there. All right. Nothing yeah, yeah, there. yeah. Stop you, going. You, and you're you've got the curse of hindsight. So yeah. You know what's coming. And you're oh, like, I need to sort it in every fucking nook and cranny. I need to get my fucking face right up there. Well, and... that's okay. Just just tell me. You no, can, no, no. You no, can no, guide I... me a little no, bit. No, I don't want to I don't want to ruin things. But you can go down there and jump under the wing because there's a, there's a an item in one of those holes. Okay. Boom. Literally right there. Don't run all the way through. Stop. Hey. Ooh, so I don't want to ruin these things for you and backseat game you. I want you to do it as you normally would, just with my commentary being less than helpful. <laughs> oh, okay. It fucking sucks. Oh, I can't parry to save his life. Oh, get reposted, bitch. <laughs> we'll get into the swing of it. Don't worry. So yeah, it's it's it's. It's just that thing, you know, when you watch someone play a game you've played to death. Oh god, yeah, yeah. And you're just there like, going, "Oh, come on, just do get the to it." Thing. Yeah. It's like when you watch certain YouTubers play games you love and you're just like, "There's nothing over there. I know there's nothing over there. Just fucking oh, move on." Man. But they have to like take their time and so I'm enjoy guessing everything. like you you and like Z you watching like a Zelda game is basically just a no. Uh, like, don't get me wrong. Some playthroughs of like, I'll I'll watch streamers play Zelda games. That's fine. Like, I I, I watch a lot of ZFG. Yeah, he does a lot of Zelda gameplays, and to be fair, he fuck it, I I really enjoy them because he he either speed runs them or he, he does something interesting whilst playing it. Mm. 
but I've seen a few other YouTubers that are like, oh yeah, look, we're going to play Ocarina of Time, which for me personally was one of the first Zelda games I actually played. Yeah. Well, I was seven at the time, and I used to get scared every time I entered the Lost Woods. <laughs> it was great. But anytime I watch like another YouTube player, a YouTuber play them, I'm just looking at it going, oh, I've seen this so much, and I know what's going on. I know what to do next. But you're just fanning around, you're wasting my time, and I just can't <laughs> be asked. And it just makes me angry. I'm it's just... like, I'm sure if I was to play a game and someone was to watch me, they'll probably be like, oh, you're doing it wrong. Like, by all means like i know we all play differently we've all got our own opinions on these things yeah well i mean you know i'm i like gaming I, I i've played lots of games in my time but i wouldn't call myself an expert in any games and i wouldn't call myself a good gamer which is probably not a good idea to like jump straight into dark souls um but you know it's it's something that I want to be better at, and I I I love the game so much. That, like you know, I love oh, I love the lore and the bosses and the story and just everything mm. about it. So if I have to struggle through and die over and over and over again just to ooh, sorry, you were dragging on a little bit there. <laughs> no. <laughs> yes. <laughs> How many is that now, buddy? I don't know. <laughs> I don't want to tell you how to play this game, but you should probably live a little bit longer. Yeah. Nothing is going to get done this episode. How far away am I from another bonfire? Is it miles? You died quite close to one. Oh, look, there's a dragon there now. Yep, he's chilling. That's nice. Ah, is he a dragon or is he a worm or a wyvern? Um, Pretty sure it's a wyvern. What's a wyvern? So, right, fucking... I know what a worm um, is. <laughs> <laughs> I think. What's a worm, Justin? It's, it's the Wrigley boys and you just can't catch them. <laughs> the little pink boys in the ground. They go. Yeah, wee, 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 wee. little doos. <laughs> fucking, you fucking idiot. No, that's not. It's not the worm I meant. I meant worm is in W Y R M. Worm. Oh no. Bye bye. See you fine. We're fine. Right. So to start with, the differences between a wyvern and a dragon. Right. Dragons have four legs, whilst wyverns have two. Okay. Uh. So they're wings and two legs, or leg leg. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, like, oh, excuse me. Smo, smo, smog, smog, smoke, smo, smoke. As in the. Uh... Ben, 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 Bob Cumberbums. Yeah. Who was a dragon? Bunokunot Cumberbums. Exactly. Is he a wyvern or a dragon? I can't remember off the top of my head. Uh. Uh, he's a wyvern then, right? Because he hasn't got four legs. Or has he? I can't remember. No. He, uh, well, in the film adaptation, I am currently looking at a picture of him now. In the film ab adaptation of um. Desolation of 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 better Bob Cubber Bums. Uh, <laughs> he is a wyvern because he's got two legs and two wings, ah, and he uses okay. his wings as handy hands. So well, well, he's not a dragon. He is a wyvern in the. So film. this guy is a wyvern. I he is a wyvern. Oh, is that a foot? No, that's yeah, no, that's a wyvern, a wyvern because his wing, his arms are his wings. Well, so it's two legs, go. two wings. And what's the difference between a wyvern? School days with J and J's. And a uh, worm. That's what we want to look at next. Da -da -da. How on earth? What, what am I meant to do here then? Uh, like it? A worm has no legs and no wings. So technically you're right with your crawly wiggly boys. Yeah, he's a wiggly boy. Uh... Well, that's, <laughs> that, that's, that's what this Expert is saying. Expert anyway. help. Uh, just dodge it and don't get killed. <sighs> it's, it's easy. Run upstairs. When he breathes down, run up. When he breathes up, run down. Just run. Good. It. Um. Does he go this way as well? No, no. He doesn't turn around that far. Ugh. I don't think so. Anyway, he might do. I can't remember. Bloody wyverns. I don't usually get attacked by him. Uh oh, drakes are a thing. So, drakes have four legs but lack wings. Oh. 
uh, worms. Did you see that backstab? No, I was ignoring you because oh, I'm more, more focused on trying to it figure out what the so difference cool, is between though. these mythological and uh, monsters. Bonk. Oh. <laughs> parry him. Oh, I'm not going to parry Go him. Go on. Ah. Oh. Parry the next enemy you come across. Uh, okay, I'll give it a go. Oh, Lothric Ooh. Lightsword, that's a, good, that's a good early game weapon. I like it. Especially if you're doing strength decks. Your strength should be more than enough. I can't use it. <gasps> you can't use it! Oh, it's decks. What do I need? <laughs> 18 decks. Ooh, that's a chunky boy, isn't he? Uchi Katana time when you get 16. Yeah. I think I will go for the, for the Katana. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> um, so, smack him. Okay. Is there a bonfire close? Uh, there is a bonfire that way. This way? Yes, but be careful when you go through. There's going to be an enemy on your left. And he's going to throw knives at you. Or himself. Ha <laughs> ha! Now we're Dark Souls in. Uh, stop. Turn around. Go through that way. Okay. I want the item. Your funeral. I want the item. Please fall off. It would make me so happy if you fell. Fire bomb, totally worth it. No, oh, now you can go back and fight the uh, puss of man with your fire bombs. <gasps> Ooh, I didn't think Ooh. about that. Yeah. Yay! There you go. New bonfire. So you can chill out, get your Estus back. Yeah. Should we? Best time in the game. Uh, I reckon you should go back and fuck up that puss of man. Yeah, but do you think I should go spend my souls? There's probably a level there first, well, right? Depends if you're a pussy or not. But yeah, sure, go spend your souls. Yeah, I'm going to spend my souls. Oh, uh, every time you defeat a puss of man, they double your soul count, though. Really? Mm -hmm. Is that a thing? Yeah. Is it? Well, why don't you fight the puss of man and find out? Jack, I don't believe you. <laughs> just go die to him again, please. It just makes you so happy whenever you die. <laughs> right, let me level up a bit, and then I'll, I'll, give, him, I'll give him another bash, all right? Oh, since you have also um, gotten rid of your Ash and Estus, you should probably take it off your hot bar and swap it for, like, item, another item you can use. Oh, okay. I haven't really got much. Is well, you've there... got fire bombs and stuff you can put on there, haven't you? Yeah, I'll have those. Oh, that's the gift. Take that off for now. I'll have a homeward bone. <laughs> I'll give you the homeward bone. Give you the homeward bone. Um, and let me use some 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 things. Let's use three of these bad boys. And then I'm going to level the F up. Ooh, so we're thinking yeah. decks anyway. Let's get some decks on the go. It's your, it's your build. Yeah. Let's do it. Touch the darkness deep within me. <laughs> oh, it's only one level. That's upsetting. Screw it. Do you know what's more upsetting? Wow. The fact that you have died... Five times in this playthrough. Well, it is Dark Souls, you know. I mean, what do you expect? I expect you to live a bit longer than ten minutes, like. And, and, it's a first time playthrough. I'll have oh, you know. Oh, first time playthrough. <laughs> I played in Dark Souls 1. Oh. I did. You did? I did. So why are you dying? I don't know. What's wrong with you? I don't know. Get good, scrub. I'm trying. <laughs> You're trying my fucking patience. I know. I know. <laughs> Ah, right, so, go mess up this puzzle man. Yeah, I can do that. I can do this. I got fire bombs now. You got fire bombs. Right, just don't... Right, just don't go down the stairs. If you follow that wall slightly to your right, there's a crumbly bit in there. Fuck up this guy now through this crumbly bit. Oh, that's easier. All right, turn around, and you can see everything. Yeah. Right, don't attack the harmless hollows, right? Yeah. It's 30 souls, genuinely not worth it. But, but fuck up the dogs. But fuck up your axeman. But all right. Fuck up your puss of man. Literally, when you get up there, don't stop. Rush him. Don't focus on anything else. Just focus on the puss of man hollow. Okay. Okay. That it. I cannot be any more specific. 
<laughs> I cannot be of any more use or help unless I grab the no, controller that, 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 and that's slap good help. That's heads. good help. That's, that's good okay. advice. So to your left. To my left. There's going to be a guy that comes up there, so you can go down and meet him halfway. There you oh. go, big Axeman. He's the Axeman! See that backstab? I'm going to have to put, like, <laughs> the Smash Bros music every time you do a backstab. Is this one of those doors the, that don't work that's as the, doors? Um, that's the yeah. push door, which you can't pull. Ooh, item, though. Yeah, but also death. Cool. Right, so if you go back up the stairs now, there's going to be one more dude who isn't disguised as anybody else. He's just a dude being a dude, looking like a Whoa. little dude. There he is. Oh, heck. I better heal. Is that a pole arm? That's a pole arm, isn't it? Or a halberd. That's a halberd. That's right? a halberd. Oh, my God. What's a pole arm? Isn't a pole arm just a stick with, like, a pointy end, but not a spear? It's like a pointy end, but, like, other pointy bits on it. <laughs> I think so. I can't remember. I don't know. Oh, Google pole arm whilst you go rush this puss of man. Don't stop for anyone else, okay? Right. Which which one is he though? He's the naked one in the very top corner. Naked okay. In the very top corner. This guy. That guy. Yeah. There you go. So he's gonna do that, and that's it. He's dead. Oh what is that? It. That's it. That's, that's all so you had to do. Tactic. I wanted to take him up properly. Yeah, you're... I am glad I got him though. I do feel I don't feel as good as if I got him like the the, the true way, but I'm still <laughs> glad that he's dead. Yeah, he's he's literally if you rush them before Mumble. they can transform, they're so easy. But as soon as they do transform, they just take so much more damage. Is there nothing else over uh, here? They can no. That's it. Oh, okay. <laughs> so I did all that for now. Pretty much. All right. Pretty much. Uh, a pole arm. Is a close combat weapon in which the main fighting part of the weapon is fitted to the end of a long shaft. Oh, I got a long shaft. Yeah, long shaft. <laughs> uh, <laughs> typically of wood. <laughs> I got a long shaft of wood. <laughs> Penis joke. Bravo. We'll just bleep that whole thirty seconds. <laughs> right, we don't need to go that way now, do we? So, oh, they can go up the ladder. Uh, mm, I don't know. No, let's go to the other bonfire. Yeah, other bonfire. That's not bad. I mean, we did... Yeah, we got, like, two bonfires. Yeah. I mean, managed to get past the dragon. Yeah. The w the wyvern. No, sorry, wyvern. The wyvern, Sorry, yeah. the wyvern. God. Many apologies. Many apologies. Hi. So how are you feeling about uh, about this run, then? About um... your, your, your many, many deaths? In which case, I actually have to figure out how to do a bloody counter for now because you cannot stop dying. Yeah, I know. It's not good, is it? I think I just need, like, I don't know, just need, like, a break. Just need, like, five minutes to just compose myself and just have, have a quiet word, you know? Just be like... <laughs> Look at yourself in the mirror and be like, you fuck up, stop yeah, it. Stop fucking up. up. You know what I mean? But I, th I think I'll be all right. I think, you know, once, uh, once, once I shake it off a bit and I get back into the, the swing of things... It'll be fine. <laughs> but anywho, I think we leave it there for now. And we can carry on in the next episode. Yeah, that sounds good to me. So yeah, right. That's us done for today. Until next time, everyone, thank you very much for joining us. Thanks for joining, guys. It's been emotional. As always, have a good day. And uh, we'll catch you in the next one. Bye! Bye! Oh, shit, it's gone too far. Bring it back around.